the first couple of levels you pretty much fly through. It's when it's, this game starts getting a bit more complicated. The Ministry of Health is a secure profit here. You'll be a good reputation to begin with once it's taken over contracts and any money. It's also a chance of emergencies. That, yeah, another mechanic it starts to introduce. Uh, Diseases such as ki the King Syndrome. Uh -huh. And you shouldn't uh, budget for building an operating theatre with a ward close, close by. Earn yourself 20,000 to make the grade. That's pretty much the, just the aim for this one. Make 20,000, cure 60 people, and have a hospital worth 80,000. This is the space you get given with to begin with. And then followed by these three separate sections there. So let's start at the very beginning, shall we? With the obvious, a GP's office. I wonder, right. Well, this is more thin than anything, I think. No, hang on, how long is that? One, two, three, four. Let me just check. I want to make sure I can actually fit a pharmacy in there before I do anything. Yeah, that should work quite nicely. You got it wrong one. Diagnosis, psychiatric. Pharmacy. Right, so that's your basic cue there. Let's know build a general diagnostic and we want this over here I think Let's have a look here. Let's actually buy buy that one there and 
turn this into like a miniature staff only area. Right, okay. One more essential, uh, let's see, facilities, toilets. Flashing plate just there. Okay, now it's time to hire our staff. He's an alright researcher, he can start researching stuff. Is I only psychiatric person? Maybe a good idea to have another surgeon on staff just in case. Oh, can't forget the nurse. Or the handyman. Or handyman actually, I'll, I'll, I'll get two. Is expensive. Think it's worth it? I need another research, no matter what, really. I need two researchers going. Patients are here at their own risk. I know what I need first, actually.
Speed up and go. Take it all out of these. Stick it back into car. One thing as well you will notice it's Holly, Colossus, Multivac. It is all other AIs, so it's AI opponents. One in another level is called HAL. So, you know, just saying. Oh, our first patient, here she comes. Some stamina, stamina slicer. So more kill equipment to come. I'll probably research in the operating room. Thinking about it. Oh. Operating room. There we go. Knocking my microphone. That doesn't help. Oh. What I'm actually going to do now, since I've actually forgot to do it, is save. It does auto save, but just in case. Heaped piles, there we go. A new disease, it is gut rot again. Somewhere with bloaty head. Oh, there's my operating table. What I'll probably do is probably purchase that. Big dent, yes, I know, but. Go back into research. Ah, oh, still more QR equipment to come. Okay. Let's move that to over here. What's ahead? Sleeping illness again, there we go.
the dirt. <laughs> okay. Spare ribs. This uh, must be an operating table. Don't have to cash for it, unfortunately, just yet. Unfortunately, send the patient home. But spare ribs, here we go. Sitting on cold stone floors. Unpleasant, unpleasant feeling of chestiness. These must be taken away, uh, taken out by two surgeons and given to the patients in a doggy bag. Unfortunately, the um, actual operating theatre is 8,000, and this is a little bit out of my budget at the moment. There we go, the squits, that's okay. Oh, we've got an emergency coming in, let's see. Four people with uncommon colds. 95, yeah, I think I can manage that. Here we are, little ticking clock here. Make sure my nurse is. Not too knackered. Not expecting anyone. Let's take her out and put her into the pharmacy. Uh, into the staff room. Oh, maybe not. She's going to be alright. Here they come. Dropped off by helicopter. Billy Savile. <laughs> oh dear. Yes, this is an old game, as you can probably guess. That's a good put that. Oh, there we New computer has been successfully researched. I think that's for the research department. And one more left. There we go. All patients cured. to the staff room I think. Doctor, attending psychiatry please. That's fucking typical. Right. Spare ribs, send them home, I can't afford it. No oh yes. Yeah, let's have him. You too. Yes, I got the maximum bonus there, that's excellent. Spare ribs, send the patient home, unfortunately. But there's another spare doctor in there. TV personalities, that's perfectly fine. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to actually build the operating theatre. How big should I build it? That should do quite nice, I think. You got the X-ray viewer there, big operating table, the all important hygiene sink and the surgical screen. Fire extinguisher, cool radiators. Do you really want a plant in an operating theatre? I'm not sure about that myself personally, but you never know. Put that there. Plant there. Bin. Bin there. There we go. And now I need to I actually need to build a ward next to it. Fortunately I am out of cash at the moment. So let's wait for that to build up slightly. 
I bet they're all in the bloody staff room, aren't they? Are you waiting for anyone? No, right. There we go. Put that into... Diagnostics. Unfortunately, I do actually know one psychiatrist. Where is he? Nurse required in pharmacy. My doctor's already there. Right, my nurse is going. There we go. And now he's just standing there doing nothing, calling a bloody consultant. Doctor required in general diagnosis. You got a G A G D rather. There we go. Perfect. Probably know the surgical one. Yep, send the patient home, unfortunately. Oh, look at this dude here. I wonder what he's got. Now, you see, this is one reason why you actually have, why you have a consultant in here. Because otherwise, you just start getting long bloody queues at your GP's office. Although in later levels, it is usually recommended to have more than one GP's office. Oh, here he goes. Dinos with the King Complex. As he gets a drink. So as I can afford to, but actually, can I afford a ward now? Ooh, it's pushing it, Dutch. Oh, an emergency. Five with heat piles. Yes. I can do that. Doctor, attending psychiatry, please. Not bad, 800. That'll do nicely. Now just research the x ray. Okay, that's that on the way. The research, let's put this all back into here. 33 33 34 Right Send him home, unfortunately. While I do that, let's actually build the ward. Just there, there we go. Another nurse for that. Mm -hmm. 
think if I get this other psychiatrist. And put him in there. Two thousand five hundred, perfect. Right. Oh, do apologize, I'm just about to chuck slightly so sorry about this. Ah, oh, sorry about that. There we go. And I'm back. There we are. Hall of Shame. I'm about the same. I'm getting better. Or worse, depending on which way around you look at it. My point the score's going up, which is always good. Let's have a look at this. I've had I'm not I'm the poorest as usual. I've got a high salary. I've got I've no I've, I've had no deaths, which is excellent. I've cured the most. I've had 50 visitors and I've got the highest value. Unfortunately, I lose 22 reputation, but very few people have come to your hospital this year. To make money, your institute needs to so to make yeah. Yeah, unfortunately, not many people come to my hospital, so I actually lose reputation for that. I get 4,000 cash from that, get 29 from that, so that's counteracted that nicely, 2,000 from that, 22 reputation from the VIP award, and obviously then the 10,000 from not having anyone dying. Let's go back to the game, and a good healthy cash injection there, we go back to this, you see all I need to do now is kill another 19 people, and I will actually win the level. Okay, so now my hostel goes quiet, which is fucking typical. Emergency. Four people we got rot nice and easy. I'm actually going to edit this room here slightly. Staff announcement: Patients with gut rot arriving. And build a computer in there. It's expensive, but it will help research greatly. There we are. I'm mean, just wandering around like you, our surgeon, you. That's like a sit in the surgery. Nice in the queue. Since he's wandering around, don't do anything, go stand in there. They can now live in there until I actually get someone coming in who needs surgery, even though I don't appear to have any patients at the moment. Someone's threatening to leave. You know what? Sod ya. Don't need one researcher.
Nice big bonus there. She has kidney beans, cause crushing up ice cubes in drinks, symptoms pain and frequent trips to the toilet. Cure surgeons must remove the beans without touching the sides of the kidney. Sir so Reginald again, yep, let's have him. Let's take my consultant out of there for a moment. Jump into there. Doctor required in GP's office. You can jump into there for now. in there. Where's he buggered off to? Well, let's put a couple of benches down in the drinks machine while they wait. I know they say you shouldn't have a drink before surgery but you know. Oh there he is. One thing I'll do as well, I forgot to do this earlier. Turn the heating up slightly, there we go. Getting onto the surgical table. You can actually get quite a lot from. I get. How much will I get for this? 1,100. And I got quite a bit from her as well, by the looks of it. And from her, which was kidney beans, I got 1,098. So you can start getting quite a bit of money. Once you actually start getting surgical stuff started out. Doctor required in general diagnosis. Did I actually hire another nurse? Yes, yes I did. So I've got one in the ward and now one back in pharmacy. There we go. No, you are needed in the ward, dear. Not wandering around, surgeon. Another emergency coming through. Uh, two people with the squits. Nice and easy. Oh, yeah. I was thinking, stop yawning. She's actually got sleeping illness, so yeah. Here they are.
that's right, they're at the front of the queue. After this guy with invisibility. Where's my nurse gone? More left. And that's the emergency dealt with. Remember this version of the game I am running here. I did actually purchase off Good Old Games, and it is actually running through a version of DOSBox. Um, the version actually comes from Good Old Games. The EXE does run; uh, it runs itself through DOSBox, but uh, does run itself through DOSBox. But then again, this version here I've tweaked slightly. It's the same version, but I've tweaked it slightly so that it actually displays properly. Otherwise, it doesn't display actually properly. And it, it 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 doesn't display properly for this Twitch screen, and, but it displays properly to play it. Way so it it all makes sense in my head. Um, bit of history about this game actually. There was actually a PlayStation version of this game. Um, trying to control this with a controller, I would not want to try and do. Uh, PlayStation Macintosh version, and obviously PC and DOS. I need to do it to win the level. Finish the year, fair enough. <laughs> 69. It's a funny number. So it's the same way if you look at it one way around and another way around. Don't look at me like that, wife. Wife giving me dirty looks then. <laughs> what are you doing standing there? Surgeon psychiatrist. Get back in. Um, the staff room. Go to the staff room. You might have a few too many doctors here. Also, thing to do. Thing I keep forgetting to do. You keep you keep forgetting to remind me. Save. There we go. She's not happy. But she's being cured, so I don't know what she's not happy about. Cold, fair enough. Oh, now she's pooping. Yeah, sorry it will be that much. Do you know something? I'm actually going to stay on until the end of the year. Where's my other surgeon? Arthur. Oh, No, you're not going to slack tongue clinic. You're going to the operating theatre. Like a good surgeon.
Okay, in all fairness, he does actually need to go to the staff room. Alright, what I'll do then. Do I actually have any more surgeons in here? Yes. There we go. Someone's wanting to quit. Uh, let's have a look. Uh, I need him, unfortunately. Why are my researchers threatening to quit? Seven people with TV personalities. Yeah, I think I'll try that. Um, yes, sir. On about looking at the Twitch chat now, there was actually a multiplayer component to this. Never tried it, unfortunately, um, as when we were actually playing this actively. Um, I didn't actually have decent internet access. It was back in the days of 56k. Uh, but it is something I would actually like to give a, uh, have a go at at some point. So if there's anyone out there with this game and like to give the multiplayer a go, just get in contact with me via the Twitch or via my YouTube channel, which is Mousels, which is YouTube forward slash Mousels. Just search for Mousels on YouTube and you'll find all my videos on there and we'll figure something out at some point. This is where my hostel starts getting a little bit busy. As a speed cure people of psychiatric disorders. Is that even possible? How how can you actually have a an emergency and several people come in thinking they're a TV personality? Oh no slack tongue there. Machines have just started to deteriorate. Let's have a look at these, shall we? That one's fine. That one's okay. That one's now let's get them repaired while they're not in use. I oh, saw a mouse then. I get them all. Oh, I think I already have. It's the last one in there. Yep, done it. Yep, I'm getting higher in the Hall of Shame, which is always good. Let's see. I've got nearly, I'm nearly enough catching up with the richest. I've got the highest salary, most cure count, least deaths, most vi or tied most visitors, and highest value. Uh, let's see, total loser. Uh, to, yeah, people still aren't coming to my hostel for some reason. But I get my cash award there, 4,000. 28 there for plus reputation. Another 28 reputation. 2,000 in cash for squeaky clean. And another 10,000 for no one dying. Yet again, another year, no deaths. Now then, the question is, when I press this cross here... I am eligible to continue on to the next level of the game. I'm going to ask you people in the Twitch chat what you want me to do here. Do you want me to continue playing this level, maybe for another six months or to another year? Or do you want me to move on to the next level and maybe do a little bit of that and then call it a night? Let me know in the Twitch chat. I'll mute my microphone just for a second while you make a decision. And I'll be right back. And I am back. Here we go. Now look, go into the Twitch chat. Move on from... Rimpton is lovely this time of year, I hear, says Bishman Rock. And Carl on Fire says, move on with your life. Rimpton on sea needs you. And then Adam, Adam Oops, just asked there, where can I get this game? You can find it on good old games. Just go to GOG.com and just search the theme hostel on there. You can find it on there. For, and I'll actually look at it this time. How much did I pay for it? Um, you can get it for free. It is, it is technically classed as abandonware. But to get a proper version, which is guaranteed to work in Windows 
97 with no issues running through its own little DOS box. It's it was 3.99 from good old games. That's 3.99 pounds. You can't go wrong really. It's a fantastic game. And let's see then. Okay. Let's go. Go 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 go. Let's get my screen sight. No, and sorry, I'm just messing about there. There we go. Right. Time to move on to Frimpton on Sea. That's level 4 of 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. There's only 12 levels of this game. This is where it starts getting a little bit more interesting. Keep your patients happy and deal with them effectively as you can to keep their deaths to absolute minimum. Your reputation is at stake, so make sure you set it to, you get it as high as possible. Don't worry about money too, too much, that'll come as your vital reputation grows. You'll be able to train doctors at, to widen their abilities too. They should be, be dealing with patients who seem to be less opaque than most. Achieve a reputation of over 500. So this is my hostel at the moment. I'm just going to slow the game down once again. My will, will I'm going to call it will might make it easier. Got this building here. These various buildings here. Yes, this game does run perfectly well in Windows 7. If you can even find a disc version of the game, which is possible, you can probably get it from the game shop. Uh, that actually runs the Windows version, which runs perfectly well in Windows 7. Uh, this game is uh, the GOG version, uh, good old games version rather, which is running through a DOS box. Shrink that now, don't be alright like that, there we go. GP's office. Family cabinet there. Chair there. Okay, I'll get this uh, little bit built up there. As I said before, this game is definitely available on good old games. And if you like your little management sims like this, it is still a very good game to get. Obviously another game similar to this I can definitely recommend is Prison Architect, which is currently in uh, Alpha, it's still in Alpha, uh, available on Steam Early Access by a company called Introversion Software, another good little British company. And that is not an absolutely fantastic game as well. I think I made that a bit too small there, aren't I? There we go. Right, glad don't charge your extra for windows. Where's the bookcase gone? There we go. Oh, it's in bookcase. Uh, let's see, treatment, inflation. Oh, I've also got my training room to build, haven't I? What sort of doctors do I have? Doctor. 
Oh, he's a good doctor. I say good. Oh, that should be okay. Let's have a look at this space here. Inflation clinic, staff room, training. Training staff room and research can all go in their own little building like I usually do. Which I think would be good. Uh, that one there. I go over here. Now I've got this little building over here. Which I'll use as a staff only area. Now I'm thinking, why have we got this such big space here? Seating. Enough said, really. Okay, behind this lot, I think I will put the ward. Nice big ward. Oh, it's not too big though. I don't want to, don't want to go stupidly big. So I could put clinic. No. Right, okay. I'll do a ward like that. Big double doors there. Nurse's desk there. I'm going to fit another bed into there, I think. Eh, yeah, wishful thinking. One over there, one over there. Uh, plant, bin, boom. And also facilities and toilets. I don't want win why do I keep putting windows in toilets? You don't want windows in a toilet. Also, given EA's recent um, track record, we'll say, with ruining old franchises, I will be very, very, un most very, very unhappy if EA did get their mitts on this and try and turn it into a mobile game. I think people would cry out even more than they did when when they got hold of um, theme hot, not um, Dungeon Keeper. Speaking of Dungeon Keeper, I do actually have Dungeon Keeper Classic on my computer as well. The classic one being the original version. I might give that a go at some point as well. A um, couple of surfers. Yeah, a couple of radiators and a plant. Let's see, pool table. Sofa, sofa, sofa. Sofa king. The Bishop Rock says we don't talk about the new dungeon keeper. No, we we really, really don't talk about the new dungeon keeper. How they could turn that into a mobile game with microtransactions of all things, I don't want to know. My wife is unhappy about it, she just said. My wife is unhappy about it. She never, never even played Dungeon Keeper. I'd be quite interested to see if she could play... I reckon, I reckon she might look quite like Dungeon Keeper, actually. Yeah, maybe. Get, like, getting to build a little, uh, a little dungeon. Fill it up with monsters. You do actually get to blow things up, Steph. Yes, you do actually get to blow things up, so... Of course, Dungeon Keeper 2 being the best version of it. Patients, have your credit cards ready? I 
Um, silly me, I don't think I've left enough room for my training room, have I? Oh yes, I have. Ooh, that was good. Skill. I want my projector there. Bookcase. Put my bookcase back there. Skeleton up there. Put my electric chairs, plant, radiator, bin. So I think that is near enough everything I need for now. I ain't got I ain't built an operating theatre though. Can I actually uh, Might be a touch out my price range, I think that at the moment. I've got a basic hospital. One thing I am vitally missing though. Staff would help. Alright, I've got one researcher. He can be my GP. I've got him, he can be clinical. I've got him, he can be in there being psychiatric. And I've got Marcel Hyle and all. Give them all in a good place together. Also, one thing I'm going to need is seating. I was really awesome. Oh, downshift. I forgot about that. While I'm building these, I'm actually going to open up the hospital. Oh no, I've got, I've got this open, never mind. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There we go. One thing I have noticed about this game as well, the receptionist never moves. She doesn't need breaks, she just stands there. Not moving. Ever. That should do it, I think. And open. Game speed back up, there we go. No point in looking at that because I don't actually have anyone in there. One thing I actually want to try and do, get this guy here, my researcher, surgeon, psychiatrist, up to be a consultant. So the first thing I need is obviously in here, consultants, there we are. That was good time if there ever was one. Let's slow the game down just again. I've got one consultant, so I'm going to hire him. Put him in there. And I'm going to take him out and pop him into there. And what that'll do, in I am not can't remember how, I think it takes about six months. In about six months' time, that will up him to be a consultant. Then that means he can then train people. When he can train people, he will train them as researcher, consultant, psychiatrists. Now, researcher, surgeon, psychiatrists, which will make life a hell of a lot easier for any training I might need to do. Although I might need to keep taking them in and out. Do you breed doctors to pass on traits? No, but that would make it a lot easier to do. Uh, where does it send there? General. Right, that's okay. I'm just going to have to keep an eye on this bit here. I never actually hired a nurse, did I? Did I hide? No, I never hired a nurse. There we go. I now have a nurse. Oh, a handyman. Why didn't you people remind me that I forgot to hire staff? Doctor, attending psychiatry, please. 
unfortunately that does mean I now need to take him out of there for a moment. Pop him into psychiatry to treat her. We've got a new disease, it's heat piles again. to my victory screen. It's just hostile value and money I need to worry about on this one. Oh, I have kidney beans. Send a patient home. I can't afford the operating theatre. I really could do with another psychiatrist. I really could do with a research, I'm actually thinking about it. Now what I'll do, I'm going to have to hire him and put him in there. Corrugated ankles, very nice. That's not curing for that. Unless he's the other been seen? Oh, must have been seen. I'm looking at Twitch chat. Hello to you too. Is that, supposed to, is that Monsieur Magnet? Or Monsieur Magnet? I do apologise. I have no trouble with English. Tending psychiatry, please. Ah, uh, the announcer on this. Not quite as annoying as Navi, but it certainly gets there. Blow to head. There we go. My patient's cured. There he's got a Q. Right, he's done. Right, out. And in. There we go. If, if I if I worked in the medical profession, I'd be quite worried if some sort of mystical floating syringe just seemed to be able to pick me up and carry me somewhere. That, that's where uh, spare ribs. There we go. Mm, still not, oh, no, I didn't want to hire him. There we go. I've got. Three people with the squits, easy. A premiership footballer. Staff announcement, patients with the squits are on the way. And 
you slicer, that's all good. Well, it's not good, I've got nowhere to put it, but it's all good. Right, there we go. Nurse required in ward. Uh, yes, we'll take a chance on that cure. Attending psychiatry, please. Put him in there, there we go. Start from the emergency. Ah, some of the psychiatrists. He's going. You go back in there. You got a cue? No, nope. like right, you come out and go into there. I will get another psychiatrist eventually. You watch, he'll become a consultant and then I'll get another psychiatrist. Oh no.
God, he is tired, he's knackered. Poor guy running ragged. Nurse required in pharmacy. Uh, send the patient home. It's her. She's got fractured limbs, but... Not what I can do about it at the moment. Sleeping on this, easy. No psychiatrists. Is it too much to ask for a psychiatrist? I need a psychiatrist. Hang on a minute. That didn't sound quite right. Alright, okay, I am now the top of the Hall of Shame, which I think is a good thing. Yeah, because I'm just getting into the Hall of Fame. I'm the poorest. I've got the highest salary. I've got the most cure count, least deaths. I'm not too bad on the visits, and I've got the highest value. What cash do I get? I get 4,000 for building up a good reputation, 22 reputation, 2,000 for cleanness, and 10,000 but no one dying. That's going to make my life a little bit easier there. And I look through here. Psychiatrist, come on. No psychiatrist, come on! Alright, what, what are you doing just wandering around, Doctor? You, go there. Alright. You, out. You, there. Right. This. Here. You send him this. Take out our improvements. Put it into cure. Take out specialization. Put it into diagnosis. There we go. Bear ribs. Send him. I end the maximum. That's good. Right. Treatment. Operation. Yo, the doctor. That's a good size for that. Extra doors. There. There. Sink. Screen. 
in plant radiator, etc., etc. Radiator in the middle, plant, and in. One of the other Yes! That's what I was after. That means that this guy who's just run off somewhere, where's he gone? This guy here is now a consultant researcher, surgeon, psychiatrist. So if I rest him up, take him out of there because I no longer need him in there, put him in GPs, my researcher can now go and be researching. That means that I can now start training up some of the doctors. But in the meantime. Please don't feed the vermin. Thank you. I'm going to have to send them home because I don't have the surgeons. That's. Never noticed that. That's one type of stuff I don't actually have. I have one surgeon. And he's in there. But that does mean if I get put him, if I get a, a junior doctor, if there is any, now only if I get a regular doctor, put him in there, put him in there as well. There we go. My heating's broken. Great. Is he doing nothing good? Can do that. We have a VIP with us. Staff announcement incoming patients with television personalities. Doctor required in X ray. Doctor attending psychiatry, please. Doctor attending psychiatry, please. No, you stop coming out. Stay in there. No. You in there. Right, there we go. Right, who's wanting to quit? I need a... Right, you. Extra. You, consultant, you're alright. Back into there. You in there. Yeah. 
is where it starts getting a bit busier. And that poor guy is just sat there. In all fairness, I think I'm going to have to attack him, unfortunately. Invisibility, there we go. I got the extra bonus on that, which is good. Bear ribs, send a patient home because I've got no bloody surgeons. I almost start seeing relatively happy. Ideally what I could do, I could do is putting him in there and while he's not doing anything oh, No, not the right to take him and start to train him up Transparency, there we are And the cure is working Build another building at this rate, I think. Factory bones falling off concrete onto the, on falling off high things onto concrete. Yeah, stay away. It's because I'm just about to build the damn thing. Send home. Kill the patient. Where? Oh, that's a shame. Oh. Well. Doctor required in GP's office.
And the hostel goes quiet. Oh, yeah. Doctor, attending psychiatry, please. All I need is one good psychiatrist. One psychiatrist. If I could get a psychiatrist, I'd be laughing. Well, he nearly is a psychiatrist because you can double check that. It's just about to come in research. It's a centre for a psychiatrist, 6% surgeon. I don't know why is that so. Surgeon, I need another surgeon. So that bloody psychiatrist, though, is it? Should actually be able to build the nast. No. Right, let's see what people think of the hospital. Uh, it's not doing too bad. It's a bit cold for them. The thirst and happiness is overall okay. Just my bank balance I need to try and start out. Is he? Doctor, right. right. You are transparency. Take a chance. You are teaching. That's good. So nearly enough a uh, research, nearly a psychiatrist, and nearly a surgeon as well. Just to confirm the wind level conditions for this level are reputation above five hundred. Hostel value over 100,000 and bank balance of more than 50,000. That's the one that I'm struggling towards at the moment. And my daughter has been promoted. He's now a researcher. Ten people. Ooh, ten. Could push it a bit. Yeah, I think we'll do that guy. Oh, I need a psychiatrist, don't I? Staff announcement. Patients with uncommon cold on the way. Doctor required in general diagnosis. Doctor required in inflator Can you sell anything to make your balance go up to the next hospital? You could sell something, but then your hospital value will go down. Oh, balls ain't got a slicer, have I? Oh, yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, that should be alright. 
hopefully done. Oh, shame at the top of the hall of shame, that's good. I'm the richest, I've got the highest salary, I'm on top of all tables. I get the 4,000 bonus, 4,000, 28 reputation, 2,000 for that. No, no deaths because someone died this year. That gives me a good cash injection. Consultant, stop. Come here, there we go. You can go in there. Surgeon, you can go in there for now. You can go into here. Don't think I'm going to manage this. Nope. Lost one. I lost two in fact. Two out of ten. Not too bad. Slack tongue, there we go. He's nearly a psychiatrist. I bring up this guy. This guy's now learning to trade. Junior's has become a doctor. Nurse required in pharmacy. By this guy here. Yep, he's now a doctor. doctor attending psychiatry, please. I think I need to build another gym. Is touring the building. I think it might be a good idea to build another GP's office. Down here. I don't have an operating theatre. Oh shit, I do have an operating theatre. What am I on about? God about that. As a VIP was walking past. Great. Doctor required in X-ray. That part of the research is just sat there. Two Boom. surgeons required in operating theatre. Help me, the surgeon gone. Are you kidding? Yes, yes, I know you're alarming out. There we go. Right. Doctor, attending psychiatry, please. Doctor required an inflator room. Doctor required in general diagnosis.
Ooh, nice. Psychiatrist yet. Nearly. Okay, we're nearly getting there with it. You watch, by the time he actually gets to be a psychiatrist, it'll be the end of the level. Now, now he's a close side of their quack with the heck there. Qualified psychiatrist. There we go. Go qualify someone. Go qualify someone? That doesn't even make sense. Oh, it's been a long day. She was nearly dying and... And she's cured, there we go. Doctor required in GP's office. Come here. Two, got ya. And that is the five thousand fifty thousand boundary hit. thousand that's quite good reputation of about eight thousand and thirty-nine and that's the end of the level so I think we'll go on to the next level there five one two three four five yes I was right And this one here, if I just pause again slightly, I have three consultants. All the other doctors I will be getting in this level are juniors. And on that note, I think that is a good place to leave it there for tonight. Yes, please ignore a bit of gra graphical glitch there at the bottom. It's just the game fouling up slightly. Yes, indeed, that is the end of... No, that's as far of Theme Hostel as I'm going to get tonight. 
close that down. There we go. Yeah, so as far as I'm going to get on Theme Hostel tonight, I think I've been at this near enough three hours, so I think that's a good place to leave it. I'll probably pick this up next week if you want me to. Let me know in the Twitch chat or on the YouTube comments below if you're watching this on YouTube later on. Uh, obviously, my name has been Michael Morehouse of Mousel's Media. I'm bidding you all good night.